If you want to know how to make a video effect that looks like this on your phone, then keep on watching. First of all, record a video of yourself scrolling on your phone and make a screen recording of the phone when you're doing that. Import the video to CapCut and then, using an overlay function, import the screen recording. To get rid of the top screen recording red icon, go to Crop and drag the top bar down. Then I wanted to fade out the bottom of the hologram so that it looks like it's coming from the phone. So tap on the screen recording layer, go to Mask and select Split. This line controls how much of it is shown and by dragging down a circle with two arrows, you control the smoothness of the fade. Next, go to opacity and decrease it to your liking to make the effect even smoother. Then I wanted to make the hologram appear from the phone and then follow the phone when it moves. To do that, we'll use keyframes. First, find a spot when you want a hologram to stop zooming in, adjust its position to the phone and select a keyframe. The first keyframe is created. Now go to the beginning of the video and make the hologram layer super small. So tap on the screen with two fingers and drag them inwards. The same as if you were zooming out on a photo on your phone. The new keyframe is automatically created. Let's have a look. Looks good to me. Let's now make a hologram move with a phone when I move. I try to be super dramatic on my video for this tutorial, moving around, but obviously you don't have to do that. So go to the first frame we created, move a bit further when you see the phone move and move the hologram. The third frame is automatically created. Do it as many times as you need. Usually the more keyframe you have, the smoother the result will be. And that's it. Let's see the final result. If you want to know how to make a video effect that looks like this on your phone, then keep on watching. And that's it. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you did, please give this video a like because it really helps me grow my channel. And please also give me a follow if you want to see more smartphone videography tutorials and tips and tricks. See you soon.